What is going on everybody? It's a little windy out today, but the temp's 48 degrees and uh, made it back up to Fairmont, Minnesota. So we're going to get out there on the boat again. Don't have any boat docks in it yet, so same scenario, but I think after the first, April 1st, which is almost here, uh, they do put them in. So hopefully by next weekend they'll be in, but uh, we're going to get out there and show you guys what's going on. Stay tuned. Okay, we are in 19 foot of water. Well, there we go. 19. There we go. Come on, Garmin. <laughs> Uh, 38 degrees is the water temp, so that's how much it's gone down, you know, it pretty much stayed the same since last time I was here, so There we got uh, fish on the bottom again, deep water, but uh, Finally got one taker here, so we're gonna keep at him Not a bad one see what else we can do, but that's what we got going on so far Just a little guy not trying to catch him that was an accident, but he's gonna go back, but well walleye nice surprise, but uh Still in that same spot, and the fish are kind of sitting there, but they're starting to get active, so we're going to sit on them for a while, see how many we can put on in the boat. Size is getting better. I'm going to have to start putting some water in a live well. We're getting it done now. They're coming in, getting aggressive. So that's what you got going on. Nice fish. That's what I'm talking about. Jigging over the side with the ice rod. Getting it done. There they are. Found them. Nice perch here. I'm gonna put him back, but kind of nice to see two different species other than yellows out here, but still a deep water. But look at those fish out there. Man, they're schooled up pretty heavy here. You can see that at 35 foot and it goes back to 65. I might try to do the old cork in here in a second, see how that goes. So stay tuned. Nice perch, gonna put him back. Well guys, 17 foot of water. Look at all them fish down there. Man. Look at this tank. Oh yeah. Ice rod's the ticket again. Minnow head with the pilkey. Gold pilkey. If you can see it there. <laughs> That's what's getting it done, guys. Another little perch here. Not bad. Getting her done. Look at all them fish down there. <laughs> all right. Gonna get him back. Catch some more. See you, buddy. This 42-inch Legends Custom Lip Ripper. I tell you what. That right there with the pilkey. That's what got these babies to bite with a light bite and being the cold temps of the water. And look at that live well. <laughs> if you want one of those, get a hold of us. We got a few of them left over. So, it's that 42 inch lip ripper, Legends Custom. Beautiful looking rod, too. But yeah, if you want to get a hold of one of those, not only does it work good for ice season. Definitely works great for jigging over the side of the boat. That was kind of what I was most excited about for it. And, well, it has definitely been a lifesaver here already in this early spring. But look at that live well. Man, lots of good fish in there. Awesome. It sure was a great couple hours. I'm trying to show you guys here. Another nice perch. Hands are freezing. <laughs> but it's uh, been a pretty good... Afternoon, I think it started about 4, so it's 6.30, so two and a half hours. Going to get him back here, but like I said, 38 degrees is our water temp, and we are in 17 and a half, 18 foot of water. That's kind of where the big fish have been. We got a good mess of fish in there, so it's been a good two and a half hours, so that's good to see. Great to see. I am actually getting kind of cold, like I said. Boy, that sun went under. It got a little chilly out here, but... Uh, Boy, these fish are going now. You know, got on them. Big school there. I don't know. Holy cow. In there. Let's let's zoom this out here. Look at them fish out there. I got the gain up too high there, but look at that. We're at 55 feet and they are just stacked here at this spot. So it won't be long before they hopefully start making their way back into the shallow water. But uh, going to take some consistent weather. But it's looking like next week we're going to get that where we're, you know, highs in the 40s, 50s, not many lows. You know mid 20s so that won't be too bad we'll see what happens but uh but yeah so fairmont there's a bite going on you know they'll have the docks in i think uh, like I said after april 1st i think they finally get them in so that'll be good uh i've been on bud lake uh, that's kind of all i did i was going to go on haul but i never got that far got catching fish wanted to bring home supper so that's what i got going on but it's been a lot of fun like i said pill key with the minnow head it was the ticket uh you know I'm sure you could try bobber to minnow, but they didn't seem to like that. It was kind of just jigging over the sides what they wanted. Again, it said light bite, not biting real aggressively hard, so you got to have that, uh, 
got to have that ice rod on the side of the boat just to kind of see that bite or feel the bite. So definitely we're light biters, but boy, there's some good sized ones in that live well. Sure has been a lot of fun. Uh, I'm not sure Justin's posted his hours yet, but don't be afraid to pay him a visit here. Uh, like I said, just kind of go to the website or give the bait shop a call and uh, check in with him. But he's got plenty of bait available for you guys. He's got minnows, got everything else you might need, got some pilkies in there. Uh, don't be afraid to stop in there and uh, check it out and get you some, some good stuff. But uh, going to be a good spring here in Fairmont, Minnesota. I can tell you that much right now. Liking the size I'm seeing. You know, numbers of fish is kind of crazy with the yellow, so hopefully we can get a bunch of them caught this spring and get a lot of them out of here. And, you know, there's other fish too. Like I said, just caught that perch. Got to get him released and, uh, you know, got a nice little walleye. <laughs> Opener will be coming, guys, so it'll be time to get out there and get a hold of those guys too. But, uh, yeah, so a lot of fun out here. A lot of fun here in Fairmont, Minnesota. Don't be afraid to give it a shot, guys. But uh, I think I'm going to call it a day because my hands are frozen and I'm going to get back to the uh, boat ramp and get the boat loaded. So, all right, guys. Well, it's been a lot of fun. Been a quick little report here from Fairmont, Minnesota. Hopefully you enjoy it. Uh, I'll try to get as many clips in there as I can of me fishing. Once again, didn't have any GoPros and hands are frozen, so I did the best I can. But hope you guys enjoyed it, but appreciate it. Appreciate each and every one of you for watching. Comment down below if you want to see any more stuff or what else you want to see from us. Uh, stay tuned. Going to be an online store getting started here so you can get yourself some Legends gear, LGS Outdoors stuff. Uh, got some shirts, uh, kind of some cool sayings coming up that you might see on there so that's going to be rolling here pretty soon so stay tuned for that one as well but as always guys appreciate it tight lines we'll see you guys in the next one